Okay, greetings everyone. My name is Jordan and I'm a developer at Anat here in Washington, DC. Today, I will demonstrate running our administrative user interface for our Cassandra API. We will provide links in the description to a workshop video that walks you through running the data migrator and APIs of our Cassandra API code. This is a prerequisite before this video. All right, thanks. Let's start. So we're gonna clone our project and change directory into our Astra UI. Okay, so we cloned it and we changed directory into our Astra UI. From here, we're gonna run npm install. I've already done so to save time, so I'm gonna stop it. And we run npm start. We should see a similar error the first time. So let's copy this. Uh, we have to copy this environmental variable and add it to this env file, or to an env file. So. Sorry about that, I don't know what just happened. Um, dot env. And we're going to add the following environmental variable and save it. Sorry guys, I was having some technical difficult, uh, difficulties. Um, so back where we left off, we're gonna save this here and we're gonna run npm start. Okay, so here we have our administrative panel. Um, the admin UI is used to visualize your Astro database presented in a tabular format and facilitate performing update and delete operations. So just a quick overview, um, individual column sorting, pagination, <clears throat> currently we have 15 articles. Um, we can edit, so let's update this here, save it. And we see an update and we can also delete. So our article is deleted. We see we have one less article in our table here. So how does this work? What if you want to say, have a column for a different key? All we have to do is take this key here and we want to navigate to views, leaves, uh, leaves table. Inside of leaves table.js, you will see this um, columns definitions. And so you add the key property as the name and the title is whatever you want the column heading to say. So that's all there really is to set up guys. Um, the API works with both. I mean, the user interface works with both APIs. Um, there's no real configuration that you have to set up. Um, it's ready for you out of the box, so uh, it's here to make your life easier. So be sure to use it, and if there's any questions, um, please leave a comment or reach out to us at solutions at anot.us. Um, and thank you guys for watching.